Duly noted, 7-22-2018. Hi, I'm Dr. Kathy Dooley. I'm here in the amazing Taiwan, teaching Immaculate Dissection. And as you can see, I've been painted by Danny Quirk for the supra and infrahyoid muscles. So hyoid assessment is something that many practitioners often skip, and hyoid assessment is crucial for anyone who may have some jaw dysfunction, since suprahyoid muscles can attach to the jaw. For people that have had a choking sensation, a plump pit sensation, like a, a lump in their throat. People that have been choked or participate in a sport where choking is actually encouraged. <laughs> uh, also, people that have just had trouble swallowing. Uh, swallowing in, uh, is a condition called dysphagia, uh, D-Y-S-P-H-A-G-I-A. And that trouble swallowing can actually lead to aspiration problems, especially in the elderly. So in immaculate dissection, we focus on assessing the hyoid, and we look at these different muscles to feel for high tonicity and see where we need to do things called pendulums, moving things in and out of their eccentric and concentric positions. If you look at the hyoid bone, this bone actually protects the larynx. It also, it houses the area around the pharynx. So when you actually swallow food or breathe air, the hyoid is helping you stabilize and position that pharynx and larynx so that things go down the right pipe. Um, so people that have trouble swallowing definitely need this area assessed. People that have been intubated need this area assessed. These muscles that you see here in the infrahyoid region, they attach to the, the thyroid cartilage of the pharynx, or the, I'm sorry, the larynx, um, the sternum, and also they can go all the way over to the shoulder. So hyoid dysfunction can create shoulder dysfunction, as well as problems being able to move the sternoclavicular joint and the manubrium. Uh, this area is a very important area to know how to locate things and assess things, especially when people uh, cannot swallow well or feel that lump in the back of the throat. So if you fall into that category of people, make sure you get someone who understands these muscles very well. If you're someone who doesn't understand these muscles very well, perhaps take an immaculate dissection seminar or level four seminar, ID4, neck, jaw, hand, and foot concepts is likely coming to a place near you where you can learn how to localize and treat these things with ultimate efficiency. You can also learn how to locate this hyode for yourself and self-assess when you need treatment and when you don't need treatment. If you're having trouble swallowing, if you're getting choked out on a regular basis in your sport, or if you just feel like you've had a respiratory infection that blocks that, swallowing your food is difficult, or jaw dysfunction is associated with your swallowing, definitely think about getting assessed in this region. Look at these amazing muscles, this amazing diaphragm of the mouth, the mylohyoid, the anterior and posterior bellies of digastric, the stylohyoid muscle, the geniohyoid muscle, also these muscles down here that are very close to the skin but medial to SCM, things like sternohyoid, sternohyoid, thyroid, thyrohyoid, and omohyoid. These areas, if they feel very tense on you, if you feel a lot of pulling, get yourself assessed for problems in this region. Dr. Kathy Dooley, I'll see you next time.